just leaving a coffee shop. Just had coffee with my friends, the ones I usually meet on the holidays. Uh, that restaurant's closed now, so we can't do that. Okay, I'm gonna head home now and go grab some tools. And uh, I'm gonna help Noel, it's not his real name. We're going to, uh, I think we're gonna tackle that deck today. So bring a mixture of tools and see what we come up with. Hopefully a finished deck. Okay, well it fit. Oh, look at that. Let's sit down. Action. <laughs> Glorious new porridge, take three. <laughs> the police are coming. Ah, that's good enough for us anyways. Excuse all the garbage and stuff kicking around, but it's a rental, I'm not picking up this stuff. But uh, that's it. The stairs are staying the same. They're not rotten enough yet. Hey, it works, it's a deck. Well, I just dropped off Noel. It's not his real name. And uh, we're done at that place. Except for, uh, I gotta go get my tools tomorrow. As well as uh, bring a drain snake. I'm gonna snake one of the drains for one of the apartments. That'll be a lot of fun. Gonna start buffing the top. It's an overcast day, so it's a perfect time to do it. It's stinking hot again, though. Well, I'm getting there. I just gotta finish the top or the side, the other side, and then that is everything buffed or polished or cut or whatever it is. Uh, then it, well, it's gotta be washed and waxed. And it's not over yet. Well, here we are. We've had a catastrophic glue failure. Uh, well, operator error always is. I uh, hit one of the side stay things, so knock the thing half in two. Anyways, gluing these back to that pad with some rubber cement. I gotta wait about 15 minutes before I stick them back on. Then we'll be off to the races. Oh, I, look at that. Oh. I've come to the conclusion that the gel coat on the bottom of the boat is different than the gel coat on the top of the boat. And that's because of how they polish up. This one gets nice and shiny. Top side, eh, not so much. If I keep working at it, I'm gonna get into the, you see there, that's the uh, black underneath. Uh, so, what do you do? You polish it as it is. Washing it down with Dawn, uh, and I'm using this on the non skid. It's working really well to get that black gel coat stains out. So I'll wash it down again, rinse it down a couple of times, and then I'm going to wash it with ceramic car wash. So this is what I use to wash the cars with. And I am super happy with this. I've never had a car wash stuff that has wax or synthetic crap in it work as well as this does. It does what it says it does. And it's just a simple put it on, rinse it off. Um, it comes uh, with another, or well, it comes with another product. You can get another product, which is the... Uh, hybrid solution spray coating which is a ceramic coating I don't know that I'm gonna do that uh, the ceramic coating because I I'm just gonna do maybe two washes with this get two layers of uh, this stuff on and then uh, in the future do a ceramic coating I'm yeah I'm not really happy with how the, the top the combings have come out I'll see uh, I'll ask around, ask uh, one of my buddies that details cars uh, what he thinks about that. Maybe there's a product I can put on and polish it or something, make it shine. 
which is kind of what this should do. Uh, okay, I'm gonna take a break. This is, uh, I've been going for a couple of hours on this. I've washed it like three times now uh, and finished doing the, the whirly thing. And I was using this stuff. Profile liquid compound for production and tooling gel coats. Anyways, it works pretty well. Well, that's better. It's not perfect, but we got some water beading. I did, uh, it's kind of sheeting on the front. What did I do? Three coats on the top side, which I'm not really happy with. But we'll, uh, we'll see what happens. Maybe I'll do another coat tomorrow or something. It's supposed to rain tonight. Uh, well, let alone. Should I wash the car now? Look at all the fuzz. That's from that wool pad. Yeah, I guess I'll wash the car. It deserves it. Still got enough car wash stuff in the bucket to do it, so I mix that last batch a little strong. That'll do. There we go, ladies and gentlemen. One clean boat and two clean cars. Boat, uh, we're gonna leave sit till tomorrow. We'll see. Maybe we'll put a coat of that stuff on. Cars clean. Well, here's one of the best parts of any job. It's the winding up of the cord. You know, you're done. And done this one. Uh, some the cord and the hose are now trying to become one. That's better. Oh, am I ever sore? These are the muscles I haven't used for a long time. Doing that deck today. I'm not used to swinging a hammer. It's not like it used to be. It's easier to tell people to swing hammers. <sighs> well, I've been to wardrobe, even showered. And am I ever stiff? Oh man. That buffing boats is. Tough work. Well, um, anyways, I, I'm going to uh, treat myself to some Rob's Wicked Chicken. Come on in, kitty. Uh, because I don't want to cook. It's, seven, it's a 7.30 <laughs> at night, so yeah, I'm going to go eat some chicken. Probably have an early evening. Thanks for watching. Please click the clicky things. Oh, remember to wash your hands, wear a mask, be nice to people, and uh, get a vaccination if you can. They're free. There's lots of them out there.